Today we have a museum grade spider in amber. One of the biggest ways that we judge the value of an insect in amber is the size of the insect. If it's a tiny spider, that's great. If it's a big spider, that's a whole different ball game. This is a very, very big spider right there. You can see it, right? So I'm gonna show you guys a video. Not only is this a very, very big spider, but it's super, super, super clear. And the piece is very, very clear, clear yellow amber, as you can see. It doesn't have a lot of flow lines, which were in the last video. I personally love flow lines, but grading amber, the more clear, the more pure, the better. So this piece, as you can see, super, super clear. Look at that guy. This whole body, he's like, Arr! he's like in like attack mode. He's like, Arr! and then when we get under the microscope, you'll see there's actually two super, super small little gnats around him. I think you can only see one. They're almost microscopic, so I'm not really focusing on them, but it's super cool. Here's my 30X magnifying glass. Check him out. And as you can see on his butt over here, see those little things sticking out? Those are called spinnerets. That is where the silk comes from out of the spider. Unfortunately, he doesn't have any spider webs coming out like they do sometimes, which is super cool. But look at that guy. Just look at him. I mean, what can I say? This is my 60X microscope. We're going under a deep dive into what we call microland. Those are the spinnerets. And I'm sorry it's blurry, but uh, it, the, sometimes the 60X doesn't want to focus on things depending on their depth in the amber. So here it goes. Boom, that's his face. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna put a little clear picture in here. Look at that, that's his face. Those are his two big fangs right there. And those are his two big like mandible type fangs that come out. And those, and you can see his eyes, those little bubbles up here. You see those little eyes on top of his head? This guy is extremely clear. Not all insects are this clear. In fact, very few are. I like to show you guys the best of the best. That's what we're all about. And um, by the way, this is number 119. If you go to check out my bio, follow the Yellow Brick Road, you're gonna find this guy. He is number 119, he is currently available. And now look at the detail. I'm sorry that it's not super focused, but oh, there's our little, there's our little gnat. There's our little gnat. It's not focusing on him super well, but we get what we get. Look at the hairs on the leg of the spider. That is excellent quality preservation. You can see tons of little hairs on him. There's his face, his mandibles, and his jaws again, his eyes. This guy is ultra clear. He's about three centimeters tall, so it's not the biggest piece of amber, but remember, it's not the size of the piece, it's what's inside. So, if you made it this far, you probably like insects and amber. Follow me, hit that follow button, like, comment, thank you very much, and I will see you on the next one.